see stars go far. Like they would have never said that to her face in person. He would some things planned for today i actually got something to do um i want to go to trader joe's it's saturday and it is 9:05. so i don't know if you remember the last time i went to trader joe's it was like crazy packed that was a sunday it was like maybe like one it was probably after one o'clock so i saw that they opened at eight Obviously, I didn't make it in time for eight because I decided to take my braids out last night. I was going to save it for today, but then I was like, I was in the mood last night. And if you have braids, when you get braids, then you know what I'm talking about. Like, if you're in the mood, take them out. If not, you're going to have them for another week and they're going to be looking dusty. So, I wanted to go to Trader Joe's early to see if that would be any different. I mean, it's still Saturday, so it might not be any different. But the plan was to, I got this new brush from, um... From TJ Maxx it's called a fast dry brush well it's not called a fast dry brush but oh I guess so speed dry because it has it doesn't have the backlight actually I could throw this one out I had this one for a long time but you see how it has the back my favorite color is orange by the way um and this so supposedly helps it dry faster and after using it today they are correct it definitely made it go fast if it looked like i was struggling struggling a little bit i was um so i do like it but i'm wondering if I'm trying to get this little piece of hair i'm wondering if i need one with thicker i don't know if these are called teeth or bristles but the black part it's really thin so I'm wondering if for my hair texture do I need like a thicker one because it did feel like it was snagging a little bit but I don't know you know I haven't used the paddle brush in a while but so anyway I don't even know what I was talking about y'all but um so yeah I took my braids out last night and the plan was today to wake up and straighten my hair but then I was like that'll kind of take some time and then I don't know um, the plan was to get up and straighten my hair, but I mean, it's not like it's going to take me hours because I mean, my hair's thick, but it's not like super long, but since I have that brush, so I'm kind of like all over the place, but you guys see how my hair looks like this. I want to get to the point where it could be like this, but curly. So I do my battery's dying. Um, I do like how it looks like this, so I think I might try it, because it's not summertime, so it's not like I'm going to frizz up, but I don't know. I think I'm just going to go like this, that way I can get my day started, and then I can come back and do, if I want to straighten it, I can, whatever, whatever. But anyway, so today on the plan, we have Trader Joe's, 
and then I might go to Bath and Body Works because I need candles but their sale right now is $14.95 and I mean it's cheaper than regular but you know they be having them cheaper than that um I need to go to Sephora because I need to get some moisturizer and then I need to go to Target so I think I'm okay with my hair like this um because you know it's giving Wakanda gotta represent and so yeah we're just gonna go to Trader Joe's like this because the girl that does my hair, I feel like she cut it nicely. Oh, I would also like to get a curly cut one day, but I want to wait until my curls are longer. Because I know if I get a curly cut now and wear it curly, it's going to be like, and I don't know. I just like how this length looks. Like, my hair curly, this length is like my goal. I don't want to get, like, curly hair down to here because I can't even imagine dealing with that. But I feel like this length, if it was curly, would be perfect. But anyway, I'm going to change my battery, get dressed, and then I will see you guys in a bit. Also, I wanted to show you guys I got some new balances. I feel like a cool kid now. Aren't they so cute? I think they are so nice. They are the 990 V4. That's which one they are. And I tried them on. They are so comfortable. I already want to get another one. I mean, like, order some more. But, yeah. Oh, wow. Right there on the tongue. The 990 V4. But, yeah. All right. So, I'm going to get dressed. And I will see you guys in a bit. All right. So, I just got to Trader Joe's. And I don't know if I'm going to you guys out while I'm in there but we'll see what happens Alrighty. Uh, all right, so Trader Joe's was a success. I um it was definitely less busy than last time for sure. I didn't pull my camera out though because it was still kind of like a lot of people and I don't know. But I got a lot of good stuff. Now I'm about to Yeah, I do have to go to Target, but I think I'll just wait till I go back to back to where where I live to go to that target so I will most likely see you guys in target I went to well I did go to Sephora just to get my moisturizer um, got some Chick-fil-a because if you don't buy food after you grocery shop, what are you doing? <laughs> um, all right. So I did stop. I did end up going to Target. So let me show you what I got. I don't know if you remember my last vlog. I mentioned I wanted to start um, getting the figment, like the green color for my kitchen. So I got two towels. Um, and then I got a spoon and a spatula or a turner. Um, I think that's all I got for the figment. Let me just make sure. Yeah, that's it. Okay. And then I got some Christmas slippers. Aren't they so cute? Rudolph. And then I got a foot mask to try. I never used one of these before, but it says for moisturizing. And I haven't gotten a pedicure in a while or given myself one in a while, so we're gonna try that. Um, I got Olipop, this is my favorite flavor. I got four of those. And then the stuff that I actually went for, some body wash, little dove. 
And this one, I don't know if it's new, but it's my first time trying it. It's called Quiet and Roar. I got Energize Coconut. Oh, so maybe they do different things. So I guess I got one that's supposed to energize. And the scent is Coconut Milk and Mango. I think it was only like 6 or $7. I like that it has the pump, so we'll see if that's as convenient as I think it might be. Some hand wipes for my car. And then some deodorant. So all that stuff was actually on my list. The slippers and all the other stuff wasn't, but let's target it happened. And now for Trader, Dro Trader Joe's. I got some chicken tenderloins. I made, um, this past week I made like a copycat burrito from Chipotle and I liked, like I was able to cook those perfect. So I was like, let me just get some more of those tenderloins. Um, some of the frozen shrimp. I got these for the first time last time I went and I liked them a lot. Some pizza dough. Um, so this one is a new try, scalloponi potatoes. Scalloponi? <laughs> Probably scalloponi potatoes. So, like I love scallop potatoes. Remember the ones from the box? My mom used to make those. I thought they were so good. So we'll try those and see how they are. I got some romaine lettuce because I want to make salad this week. And then I got these to try. These are chicken breast nuggets. And the thing that piqued my interest is they don't have red meat. And I feel like I can rarely ever find chicken, like pre-cooked chicken that doesn't have red meat. So I got these. I hope they're good. You know, for one of those quick nights when you don't feel like cooking. And then I got the Alfredo again. And then I got some hard salami to like snack on, but this is applewood smoked. I usually get Genoa. I think that's how you say it. So hopefully this is good. If not, I think it was only like $3 and some change, but it looks good. Like, you know how they have the ones with the black peppers in them, the black pepper seeds? I don't really like that one, so that's why I got this to try. So hopefully it's good. And then I got some lunch meat, oven roasted turkey breast. This is my first time trying this as well from there. My mom got one last time. I don't think it was this one. I think it was the one in like the longer pack. She said it was good. So we'll try that. And then I got these again. Which I think are so yummy. And then this, I started to get um, two boxes cause I really, I like this way more than I thought I would like it. But I was like, let me just stick with one. So I think it's, like six in there so i feel like i it's either four or six because i only eat one i make it with french fries but they're so good but i was like if i just get this one then that means i'll have an excuse to go back sooner <laughs> and then i got this ravioli again i don't know how to pronounce it i think it's cacao the pepe hmm. but yeah i really like that last time so and i just put that with butter and um maybe salt i don't i feel like i didn't even season it but it was really good the flavor is good and then i couldn't resist i got another plant <laughs> but i think it's just so cute but this one it doesn't it doesn't have like the stick in it so i don't know what it is but i just think i like this too i like these colors but isn't it just so cute, whatever kind of plant it is? I like that. And then I got this humongous water because I didn't take any with me and it's the biggest bottle of water I ever had. It was only like a dollar. Okay. And then I got some eggs because I, I want to make some shrimp double eggs, like just because, so. Got some of those. And then I got these plantain crisps. This is my first time trying these. 
I don't know if you've ever had the 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 Goya brand. It's like in a little white bag. Um, they're like this. I, the at least the Goya ones look thicker. I don't know how if, how thin these ones are, but I like I like to eat these. They're really good. And then I got some penne pasta because I haven't made pasta in a while. And I probably will. I don't know why I'm explaining why I got the stuff I got. Sorry if that's weird, but I don't know. Um, and then two avocados. Like I said, I'm going to make salad this week. And then the last bag. These, of course, I have to get these every time I go. <clears throat> White cheddar corn puffs. And then I got some ground turkey. Hopefully this is the right one. I think it is because it looks like fatty, I guess. One time I got, I think when I went to Wegmans, I got the super lean one and it was disgusting. I did not enjoy it at all. Um, and then the last meat I got was ground beef. And then I got this to try, sparkling apple cider. They had a lot of um, stuffing flavored snacks. I don't like stuffing, so I was just imagining they were disgusting, but like for their seasonal stuff, they had some cool things, like it was popcorn, I think it was chips, like it was a bunch of stuff. So I didn't get anything seasonal. But um, so for a dessert goodie, I got cinnamon coffee cake. I love coffee cake, so hopefully this is good. It's just a small one, perfect for me. It looks really good, so I hope it's really good. And then I got um, the mango juice smoothie again. I got that last time I did like that. And then I got this to try, 100% cranberry juice, not from Concentrate. Um, it has 17 grams of sugar. Again, I'm not sure exactly what that means, so I guess it's not super sweet, but obviously it's gonna be sweet somehow, but I like cranberry juice, whether it's like um, the cocktail one or regular, so. I figured I would try this because this might be seasonal because I feel like I didn't see this last time, but it could be for like Christmas, not necessarily. Well, I guess since you make cranberry sauce for Thanksgiving, so maybe it is Thanksgiving. Um, so I got that, and then I've been seeing this on Instagram. People, I've the recipes that I saw, they made it with eggs. I think I was looking up <clears throat> like avocado toast videos. And they was using this with the eggs. But I know you use it with a bunch of stuff. So I was like, oh, I need to try this. So, yeah. Crunchy chili onion. So that's all my stuff. And it came to 107.67. So, yeah. So I'm about to wipe all of this off. Put it away. And then eat my Chick-fil-A. <laughs> It's, it's trifling to buy a hundred dollars worth of groceries and then go get fast food <laughs> but um yeah and then i will see you guys later because so i got um i don't know if you remember one of my last vlogs i uh i mentioned how i was gonna like redo my closet not necessarily for like um like for it to look pretty but just to be like a bit more functional so i did end up getting the cube shell so I'll have to put that together and um, I'm expecting some drawer organizers from Amazon today. So if they come, I will organize my, my junk drawer is trifling for real. Like it's a junk drawer, seriously, like it's bad. And then I need a, um, like my forks and spoons, I need a better, bigger organizer. So I got one of those. So if that stuff comes today, we'll do that as well. And then after I put my dresser in the closet, I'll probably move my desk into the room because I'm, I'm thinking that's where I'm gonna put my Christmas tree, but we'll see all that later. So I'm gonna wipe these off and then I will see you guys later. All right, so <sighs> I um here goes the this thing's pretty heavy, by the way. I made a semi-attempt to straighten my hair. 
I say semi because it's still kind of fluffy. But I was afraid to, to like, I guess do it silky because I don't want to damage my curls like I've done in the past. But um, so this is the the uh, what what is this called? Organizer, cube organizer. Um, shoot, I want to do it in here. I really hope I did not just mess something up. I want to do it in here because I have more space. But hopefully, it's not so heavy that I can't um, take it to my bedroom. But yeah, so I'm about to watch TV and do this, and hopefully, it's pretty easy. This will be the second thing that I got from Target to put together. I'm usually decent as long as the, um, what do you call it? The instructions are pretty okay. So right now I'm watching TV. I was checking out the new Basketball Wives. I say new because it's not new, it's just Evelyn came back, but it's whack. So I'm gonna put something else on. So yeah, let's go. I need to go 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 Feelings today swing like you Timbani catch you, what you I'm a white dog in the shoe Why you say I did nothing for you And if I do anything you want me to do Timbani catch you, what you I'm a white dog in the shoe Why you say I did nothing for you And if I do anything you want me to do Maybe another time, maybe another life You go be my wife and we'll get it right Don't class, that's last Everybody go your breakfast. Have to say bye bye, oh bye bye, oh to the love of my life, my eye, oh don't cry, oh I need people and shadow, I need people and shadow, I need people and shadow, I need people and shadow.
Last, last. Now everybody go to our breakfast. Oh my god, people are like so what what's the word? They are so like bold and confident on online. Like they would have never said that to her face in person. People just social media gives people the confidence to say whatever they want. Alright, so I finished, but when I was hammering in the nails, I caused a little bit of damage. So maybe I'll just put the cubes in there, but <laughs> the nail like uh, slanted a little bit. So that one there up at the top and then that one there. So, I mean, I don't care enough to be like, oh no, it's ruined, but we'll see. So now let's go ahead and straighten out the what you call it <laughs> um so let's go ahead and straighten out the closet and let's see I don't have a light so let's see how this goes let me open the blinds see if that will help at all it's like I think it's four o'clock right now, so it wasn't super sunny today, but the su the sun is behind the clouds and all of this. So I just got this four pack of drawers. Is that what they're called? Oh, storage bins, but you know, use them as drawers. Got this from Target as well.
everybody go to breakfast. So, here is the semi-final project. So, I don't know if you saw, well, as you saw, I was stuffing all the purses that I have in there. That's, that's just for now. I'll probably think of something or find something bigger for that. And then I just put the sweatpants, jeans. I don't have a lot of clothes to make it the nice rainbow, like all the often walk-in closets. Like I said, this is more for function than fashion or whatever you want to call it but um i like how it turned out and i'm not sure um what i'm going to put in these the empty ones i put my workout shirts um in that bottom one and um i have a lot of stuff that can probably go in like my storage bin and i'll probably do some more donations because a lot of the stuff that i was looking at i'm not gonna wear it like i just know i'm not so but yeah so this is what it's looking like and I still have to figure out about the uh, all these hangers <laughs> but um and then the blankets I do want to get some more like uh, I don't know if it's gonna be like the storage bins like this but I want to get something for storage like for the top and I still I don't know what I want to do with those uh, photo albums but yeah so and I had this sitting up top <laughs> so I just figured I'd put that there I don't know what I'll put in there I have a lot of pictures to choose from but it's it matches the that and the gray so but yeah so I'm just gonna finish organizing that and go. so yeah um, I'm just gonna finish organizing that and I'll probably will see you guys tomorrow because I'm not gonna do anything else for the rest of the night. Um, I've been doing laundry. I don't know if you guys can hear the dryer in the back like in between putting that shelf together. Oh yeah, the shelf was pretty easy. Um, it was like a little hard. It wasn't hard but like kneeling down on the floor made it uncomfortable so you saw me like trying to sit on the blanket and kneel on the blanket but um, it was pretty easy. Like I said, I did uh, mess it up <laughs> a little bit, but not to the point. Like, you can't tell. You have to be all up in there to see that. But uh, even though the instructions say you need two to three people. So at first I was like, what the heck? Like, I didn't think I was going to be able to do it. But you definitely don't need three people or two people. You can do it by yourself. Um, oh, and you saw my little, um, what do you call it? My little... I don't know I didn't want to drag the storage thing on the floor and then it was too heavy for me to lift it up and like walk with it so I just put a blanket on the floor and kind of like walked it on top of the blanket and dragged it in so if you're doing something by yourself that's a little tip for you but um yeah if I do anything else interesting tonight I will grab you guys but like I said I don't think so so I will probably see you guys in the morning I know who did, and I know that they're both like a bad, bad, bad,